Hi guys again. Let's start the other part now. We will connect the spine animation controls to the to the spine rig. We will make this uh, with uh, helpers. Let's start uh, now. Uh, let's create a helper. I'll make it box. Let's rename it. It will be point envelope pelvis. And let's align it to the first helper. Let's change the size because it's too big. Let's make it 10. Let's put it to the layer objects to height. I will change the color because I like to have a dif uh, difference between the helpers. Let's make it blue. Okay, now it's visible better. Copy the helper. Align it to the thorax and helper. Let's rename it point envelope thorax. Opa. Thorax. Okay. Now let's link the uh, point envelope helpers to the animation controllers. Now we're gonna freeze the transforms of the helpers. Now let's uh, connect the two helpers to the spine, to the spine rig. This will make by skinning the the spine of the spine by skinning let's make uh, let's uh, select the skin modifier you can select it and from here here is the skin and uh, like bones we will add the two helpers they will drive the spine by driving the the spine Let's select the two helpers. Objects to hide there and objects to hide. Point envelope pelvis and thorax. Here they are. Okay, let's check what we have now. Everything is fine. But uh, if you see, the spline curve is not 100% uh, uh, smooth, there is a corners here and we can fix it uh, by adjusting the weight, weight of the vertices of the spline. And uh, after that, uh, the spine will twist uh, smoothly and nice.
Okay, let's make it uh, with the first helper. Okay, select edit MPOP vertices, and now we have to select uh, all the vertices where we have connections, where the bones have connections, not not all the vertices. Look how many are they. We have to select only where we have connections. Here, here we have connection. Here, here. here and here now we have selected all the vertices and open the weight table you see that uh, we have a lot of vertices here and uh, we will select only selected vertices okay now they are exactly what we selected we see here the weights are the first helper envelope and the second helper uh, the uh, thorax now set the weights of the vertices here here the first vertex the weight will be 100% here the second uh, vertex this the fourth will be the weight will be less the weight of the first uh, the second vertex or the fourth will be 0 0.25 and the seventh vertex or here the weight will be 0 0.5 And again, here will be zero point point, and here here will be zero point twenty five. To check what we are doing, we can make a simple animation. Not animation. We can simply move the spine and you will see how it's changing the curve if you put this 0 0.1 0 0.25 and the tenth will be 0. Point. Will be zero point one. Okay, now it's better. If you see now the curve. is twisting smoothly there is no corners let's check it in from here ok let's uh, check uh, and with rotating We have a problem here, we will fix it. Next on it going in this point. Edit and the loops. And the vertices again.
let's make it here 0 0.2 0 0.5 Let's check it now. Now it's everything okay. Now it's fine. Now the twisting, the curve is very smooth. Okay. We don't have uh, no more corners in the rotation. Now we have to do the twisting of the spine because here is not twisting yet but this we will make in the next tutorial.